Larry. Well, we talk about our value as uh, if you think about a wall and an insulation being you know R10, R16, R14, R22. Ceilings are supposed to be R32 or 38. Um, so it's how well it regulates. It's how well it. It, it keeps uh, the heat and cold from transferring into mm -hmm. your, your... It's like a your, thermal break. Yeah. Like okay. it's stopping it from coming in. Okay. And so most walls, right, a two by four wall will be R14, right? You know, when you compare the 14 versus one, mm -hmm. right, or or even 14 versus two, there's not a big difference. Right. And so, um, you know, there, there's so much information here. The problem is, too, is, is that our energy bills, okay, only about 40% of, if you got a $100 energy bill, only about 30 to 40% of that is spent on heating and cooling. To expect that you can change the glass from an R1 to an R2. And then and see take a noticeable. The, and see a noticeable difference in only the 30% of your energy bill, it just doesn't happen. Mm -hmm. And so the statistics are it's 40 to 120 years to expect a repay on b changing out historic windows to insulated glass windows or to new windows and to expect to see that savings in an energy bill. Mm -hmm. The problem is you can't get to 140 years With because, the window. the, because the window's going <laughs> to rot out too fast. So what do you recommend to the people in those colder climates? If Is this an option for them it's where they so, can... There, there's a couple things. There, there's a one of the things we're offering is is a it's a product called Pilkington Spatia glass, okay, and it is a vacuum sealed piece of glass, okay. So most insulated glasses are not vacuum sealed, okay. Vacuum is you're sucking the air out of it. They are sealed, but they're but there's still air inside, okay. A vacuum seal is actually where you're sucking all the air out of that, and mm -hmm. um, in this case, there is a little metal nipple, little black dot on the mm -hmm. glass in the lower right-hand corner. And if you look closely at that, there, there's these tiny balls about one inch apart. And the balls are a 64th of an inch, yeah. maybe 138th of an inch. Mm -hmm. Teeny, you got to look and see, you just see them. But the glass on the outside has been brazed with glass. Okay, so, there's a, so the glass has been melted together. Mm -hmm. So the seal is really good. But that dip, when you have a insulated piece of glass, you know, it's half an inch apart as an R value of one, a the similar piece of, of insulated glass, of vacuum insulated glass, can Pilking have an R value of four or seven, okay? okay? So it has a better R value than even the triple pane glass. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so in those climates, that's, 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 what, you would that's what you would use. Mm -hmm. Because the glass is the weak point. Wood is actually a great thermal break. Okay, mm -hmm. wood is oh, yeah. wood is a is an insulating property. Hmm. And and if you think about it this way, if you light a match, I mean you can hold on to that match for a long time. That oh, flame yeah. is almost right at your finger before if you light a match and stick a stick a, 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 a paper clip in there. Oh, and and yeah. you can have like two or three inches of paperclip. If you put it in there, that thing will be so hot you'll have to drop that yeah. paperclip. Yeah. What's happening? The transfer of heat through through that piece of metal is very fast, mm -hmm. and wood is a great thermal insulator, right? And so, so when you're looking at windows that right. have a metal outside, they're all just or steel windows or oh, that explains you, you know, you know you, <laughs> yes, or or the aluminum like, or the I'm aluminum extruded windows. <laughs> yeah, that's what we have. Yeah, they they're uh, they're terrible. In fact, they are conducting heat and cold <laughs> into your house. Good. Okay, so that's what you have. <laughs> that's fun. Typically, glass is the weak point, but when you get into metal and you know vinyl and all those other things, they aren't as good as 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 wood as the thermal insulator. Yeah. That's a really, I, I think that's a really helpful piece of the puzzle just for a lot of people to understand. Because, uh, I mean, you hear a lot like, oh, you got to get the windows replaced to really help oh, change your thing. And it, it's probably the biggest lie in remodeling and building today.